Hello and welcome to another Hotcakes Commerce instructional video. So this video is going to walk you through how to set up hotcakes. This is really easy. Uh, you know, we, we created a nice little setup wizard for you that's going to get you through this. You really, uh, you, you shouldn't have too much trouble with this. So uh, an overview of what we're going to talk about, you know, we really are going to keep this as quick as possible so that, you know, you can get on to whatever else it is you're doing. Uh, but what we're going to do is we're going to walk you through how to install the the, uh, the modules, um, how to find the admin, you know, how to run through the, the, the uh, setup wizard, and then just explaining to you how modules get placed for you. Um, so prerequisites. Uh, this assumes that you already have DNN installed, so there is a, a, a video that we have as well that tells you how to install DNN. So if you have any questions on that or you don't have one set up for you already, it's, you know, it's really straightforward. I think that's maybe a seven or eight minute video, so you should be able to get through that pretty quickly. So uh, first, in order to install and set up hotcakes, you do need to download the package. Um, once you've downloaded that package and you're going to just install, install it into your DNN website as, a, as an extension. Uh, then you'll run through the setup wizard, and then you'll be able to check out the uh, the pages that, that get dropped down there for you. And uh, you know, one thing I will tell you is that uh, we created an install cheat sheet, and the install and the install cheat sheet has a nice uh, does a nice job of putting all this together for you. So you can kind of see where to where to go and look for this. So now right here, you can see you know on the download page, you know, or uh, on the on the free trial download page. So if you go through the free trial uh, process, then you know what what the, what you get there and what you get on that page is a, a module package download and then an install cheat download. Make sure you grab that cheat sheet. You know the, there's a lot of good information in there. Um, you know definitely it's a, you know, the kind of stuff that you need to, to get started. Um, but you know for for our purposes here, we're just going to quickly run through this and you know this this assumes you have the module package right there. So I'm going to switch over to my VM and you can see right here that I've got my my uh, DNN installation already set up, so this is localhost at hotcakes video. So what I need to do to install the extension here is I'm going to go to host, and I'm going to go to extensions. And install and stack extension wizard. I'll go ahead and grab that download, the hotcakes commerce 1.05 install, that's the current version. And we'll go ahead and install that. Now, one thing you notice, it does ask you if it's okay to install the master page. Um, th that's fine. That's a file that's included within your. Um, that's a file that's included right within your uh, your admin. It kind of tells the admin how to look. So that's fine. Don't worry about that. You can go ahead and accept that. I'll go ahead and continue through here. There's some release notes, and this is the agreement. Uh, definitely recommend that you read that before accepting it. And we'll go ahead and click next. And this is installing the modules. So once the modules are, are done, you know you see that that was installed correctly. So now I can return back to the website. Um, once I return back to the website, uh, there's going to be a new link within the admin menu. Okay, and so that's going to take us right to the Hotcakes administration. So this is just restarting, getting through there after installing the module. So I'll give that just a second. This is where some hold music would be great, right? <laughs> All right, so go ahead and go under admin, click on that, click on hotcakes administration. And once you click on the hotcakes administration, this takes you into the admin. Um, you know, and since this is the first time that, that we're loading this, um, you know, the, once we get into the admin, you know, we'll, we'll see the setup wizard pop up. So see right here, welcome to hotcakes, and this is a start the configuration wizard. So I'm going to go ahead and start the configuration wizard. This is asking me for some pretty straightforward information. So it's asking me for a... Uh, you know the logo of my website, and so you know choosing that logo, you know that that's what's going to show up on uh, you know emails that go out, email templates. Uh, so that's where that's that's where that comes from. Store name again, this is what comes up on your uh, uh, your emails and correspondence that go back and forth. Um, your store address, you need this for calculating shipping. Um, so company name, I'm just going to put Hotcakes Commerce LLC, and we'll say 309 Mile Street. Suite 500, West Palm Beach, Florida, 401. And again, phone number, this is used for uh, shipping. Uh, so we're in Eastern Time Zone. We're using uh, United States dollars. Uh, the URL configuration over here, so this is this is uh, uh, the the root URLs for all of your you know, for all of your dynamic pages. So it's be like slash store, slash category, slash category name. And then same thing with product slash store slash product slash product name. Yeah, m maybe you have uh, something different that you want to put here. So you know, if you wanted this to be, uh, you know, slash store slash uh, fancy products, you know, then you'd be able to do that. 
and then that would be at the front of, of all product pages that, that get get done there. So uh, go ahead and click save and continue. It'll take us to the next page, which is setting up our, our payment. Uh, I'll go ahead and use credit card, and I'm going to use the test gateway and edit the settings here. I'm going to go ahead and leave this as it is, so um, all of the all the tests are going to pass there. So uh, we'll go ahead and charge and um, full amount of checkout, and we'll require the CVV. Actually, let's uh, authorize at checkout and then have a capture of the funds be a secondary step. Um, go ahead and save that. So now we're using the test payment gateway. Shipping. Uh, this is going to have our, you know, basically the, the, the shipping zone set up automatically for us. Um, not going to do a handling fee. I'll go ahead and do a USPS live rates. And so I'll add those in there. And let's just do uh, first class and express mail. And we'll do this to all shipping zones. And we'll call this USPS live rates. And save that. And no handling fee. So now it's going to taxes. So taxes, uh, you know, we have a default tax schedule set up. Uh, you know, if we wanted to go in and set the tax rates, you know, by by uh, you know country or by uh, state, you know, we'd be able to do that here. I'm just going to go ahead and leave uh, the default options there, and you'll kind of come back and do that later. Last is uh, setting up the licenses. So this is your your uh, your hotcakescommerce.com website account. Uh, if, if you have that set up, then you know, then you can do that here. I'm just going to go ahead and complete the configuration now, and that'll just continue in trial mode. So once I've done that, you know, now we have the uh, the dashboard that we're here. You know, we've got a little message here pointing out the fact that we're we're in test mode. And now if we go to the store, you see that there's been a, a page that we dropped in there automatically for you, and we actually set up all the pages for you that you'll need. Um, they were just underneath this hotcake store menu. So the category viewer, the product viewer, any product reviews, those are all right in there. Um, so basically all, all the pages that you need to run your e-commerce website are dropped in there for you automatically. So you don't have to kind of hunt and figure out how to place those. And you just move the pages around to, to fit within your store. So uh, that's the end of uh, this demo. You know, we'll, we'll dig deeper into those features in, in future demos and future articles. I uh, just want to give you a quick introduction on how to use this. Um, so. You know, again, just want to thank you for watching this video. We did try to keep it short. Uh, you know, one thing I want to point out again is just that install sheet, cheat sheet, so it goes into a little bit deeper details on some of the things that you need. Uh, you know, gives you some some links for setting up your uh, your payment gateway and, and your, you know, your, your live rates, things like that. Um, you also check out the installing DNN video that'll get you started. Um, I will point out that we have a, a great community section of our website. Um, you know, if you ask a question on there, we're going to be right on it. Um, also, you know, if you have any, uh, you know, if you have any inquiries or, or you know, perhaps you want to have a, uh, you want to suggest a feature, go ahead and do that there. Uh, we actually did use our suggest a feature um, part of our website to to include, uh, you know, some features into our into our quarter one release here, and you know, we are paying really close attention to that. And you know, we definitely would ask that you know, that, that you understand that that's something we care about, and we'd love to see you participate in it.